Lorraine. Don't lay into me, George. I've got something very important to say, and then I'm going to be leaving again. I've got something important to say, too. I was attacked it's and robbed. It's always about you, isn't it? You can't just wait and listen to my news. Oh, no. You have to go and beat me to the punch. That's right. You two sort things out. I've got some business to attend to. I'm more together than I've been in months, George. For your information, I haven't had a drink all day. Et voilà. Donc on va aller voir un bif et on va enquêter sur lui. Biff. Whoa, settle down there, fella. You beat up my dad. Do we have a problem here, citizens? No, no, officer. Just a little misunderstanding. I'm sure we could work it out. Right, Martin? Sure. Okay. Let me know if you need any help, Mr. Tannen. <laughs> now let's see if we can get to the bottom of this. Yeah, let's. Alors, pourquoi tu t'en es pris à mon père? Why'd you hurt my dad, Biff? He never did anything to you in this timeline. Timeline? What are you talking about? Don't play dumb. I saw you on camera. I can't hurt anybody. Thanks to Citizen Plus, I blow chunks whenever I even think about doing bad stuff. <coughs> See? Où est-ce que tu étais quand mon père a été agressé? If you didn't beat up my dad, then where have you been for the last couple of hours? Well, I was, I was. What? That's strange. I, I don't remember. Quelle est la dernière chose dont tu te souviens? What's the last thing you remember before your memory loss? Well. I was handing out flyers for the Citizen Plus program, just like I'd been doing all day. I just finished giving some leftover bologna to a cute little squirrel when Miss Edna came by. Edna? Yeah, she wanted to run a, a, a diagnostic on my Citizen Plus watch. I must have fallen asleep or something, because when she was done, it was an hour later. And then your mom came by. Edna traficoté ta montre. So the last thing you remember before my dad got beat up is Edna fiddling with your watch. Yeah, that does sound pretty bad, doesn't it? Laisse-moi jeter un oeil à ta, à ta montre. Biff, your watch. Does X11 mean anything to you? X11? Is that a new band or something? I don't go in for that new hippity hoppity stuff. It's not a band, Biff. It's a mode on your Citizen Plus watch. Weird. I've never seen it look like that. Heck, I can barely get this thing to stop blinking, see? <laughs> uh... Cool! Right. X... 11. Yeah? <laughs> okay, that's weird. Très bizarre. Qu'est-ce qui va pas chez toi? What's wrong with you? Tu as attaqué mon père? Did you attack my dad? Mm -hmm. Now we're getting somewhere. Pourquoi tu as attaqué mon père? Why'd you attack my dad? Qui t'a demandé de faire ça? You must have been hypnotized. Who put you up to this? Mm -hmm. Guess that'll have to wait until after I get the tape. Est-ce que tu pourrais euh, te toucher les orteils Could you, uh, touch your toes <rire> euh... hmm. Fais la danse des canards. Do the chicken dance. Yeah, he's hypnotized, all right. <rire> Donc, euh, oui, le, le mode X11, comme vous venez de le voir, euh, se transforme les gens en, en zombies euh, sous nos ordres, en fait sous les ordres de la personne qui a activé le mode. Où est la cassette de, de mon père Where's my dad's tape The decycling bin Tu pourrais récupérer la cassette de mon père Could you do me a favor and go get my dad's tape Hey Mr. Tin, what's up uh, uh, uh... Is that McFly kid bothering you? Uh... Hey, you can't go in there! Uh... 
smokes what happened to him i don't know no one's ever jumped into the decycling bin before well where does it go that information is above my pay grade oh geez i'm in a lot of trouble now don't move a muscle mcfly i gotta go tell citizen brown about this i've got a really bad feeling about this well here goes nothing Gosh, ma'am, did I do something wrong? Did I do something? Mr. Tannen, I put a lot of work into honing you as the first Citizen Plus. What on earth possessed you to assault a police officer and dive headfirst into the decycling bin? Did I do all that? Lord, I thought your father was dim. No, really, I don't remember doing anything like that. The last thing I remember, I was showing that nice McFly kid my watch. Then, blam, I'm down here and you're yelling at me. McFly? <laughs> McFly. Strickland. Oh, hi, Martin. Give me the tapes, Edna. Mr. Tannen, please restrain our guest. Uh... Stop! Stop! Oh no. <laughs> Edna, what are you doing? What I've always done. Keeping Hill Valley safe from hooligans like you and your father. Come on, Biff, step out of it! Mm, bah, Biff is completely... Uh... Complètement zombifié. Porno. Look! Girly mags! Boobies! <laughs> Tannin! Focus! Uh... Look at all these unhappy pinball parts. Biff! Aren't those your favorite cigars? Cubans! What's going on? Biff! Howard Tannin! Obey your programming! Uh, uh. You see, Mr. McFly, thanks to the enhancements I've made to the Citizen Plus program, I can bring even the most rabid of dogs to heal. Oh dear, Mr. Wilson, you have been a naughty boy. Hey, it's Wild Gunman! Not a fan of video games, huh? Isn't that the license plate to your car? Sheila? Where am I? Tannen? I didn't go behind my namby-pamby husband's back so you could wallow in your vices. <laughs> it's no use, Einstein. <laughs> Doggy? Tannen, listen to me! Uh, babes. Uh, booze. Mommy? <laughs> Tannin! Get up, you useless slacker! Come on, Edna, give the poor jerk a break. A break? You sound like my wishy-washy husband, always trying to find the good in people, never wanting to accept the fact that some people are just born bad. Maybe, but that doesn't give you the right to turn them into zombies. Now, give me my dad's tapes so I can- You mean those tapes I erased while you were struggling with my zombie? What? Come on. Utopias are fragile things, Mr. McFly. 
especially when overseen by minds as distractible as my husband's. No. Okay, no. Edna! Doc? Emmett, what are you doing here? I came down here to investigate a troubling report involving Mr. Tanner. Doc, you gotta stop her. She... Silence! Okay. <laughs> I was concerned there might be a flaw in my Citizen Plus program. Imagine my surprise when I found my wife perverting my life's work. Is this what it's all been about, Edna? All those years? All our struggles to cure society's illnesses? Just to create a world where free will can be turned off with a flick of a switch? Oh, please, Emmett. You wanted this just as much as I did. Remember? If only we could tell someone to stay off the grass, and so help us, they would never tread foot on a well-manicured lawn again. That's what Citizen Plus does. It makes rules unbreakable. I only gave it the slightest of changes. Enough. We will not have this discussion here. But... Go home and wait for me. Fine. Doc. Ah! Father, what have I done? I'm sure he wouldn't blame you for all this, Doc. He was so happy when I gave up my childish dreams in favor of Edna's more practical pursuits. Are you proud of me now, Father? I'm sorry about Edna, Doc. She didn't seem so bad back in 1931. No, she wasn't. When we were first dating, she was so spirited, principled, compassionate. When did I lose her? Doc, don't be so hard on yourself. This Hill Valley may be a little messed up. Okay, a lot messed up, but you were just trying to help people. Or was I just entranced by the challenge of transforming the human psyche like so many chemicals? Ah, enough wallowing. What's done is done. It's time to look forward. Maybe, but maybe not. What? Your notebook from the other timeline. Not this foolishness again. Look, you can use it to repair the time machine and fix all this so it never happened. Everyone could be back the way they're supposed to be. You, Edna, Jennifer, my parents. Doc, you once told me if you put your mind to it, you could accomplish anything. Well, accomplish this. There's a lot of empty pages. The only one you need is right here. Take time, of course, but once it's done, we'll have all the time in the world! Ha <laughs> ha! Doc? Martin, we must get started at once. Come on! Can we bring Aini along? The dog. Yes, of course. You know, I used to love dogs before Edna came along. You don't say. I'll go ahead and start preparing a lab. Edna will be furious, but who cares? We've got a time machine to fix. Woohoo! On retrouve notre doc. Je vous remercie d'avoir regardé cette vidéo et à bientôt pour la suite du walkthrough de Retour vers le futur.